want you to take the ball as if it's almost like stuck to your ear. So you're just going to turn and you're going to, and all you're going to work on is just keeping that arm slot in the, yep. Yep. So you can see I'm keeping my exact same arm slot from here. Boom. Boom. Now, good. When you're doing it, make sure that your elbow, see how my elbow's up and it's not staying down? My elbow's staying up like I'm pulling a bow and arrow back. Boom. And I'm getting on top of the baseball and it's firing through. Good. Now you're going to start in your fielding position. Hey, watch when I get to here. So my hands stay. Then when I shuffle, look. We're going to do our next drill. It's just going to be, you're going to take your body, right foot, you're just going to put your chest over, and we're just going to toss balls nice and easy. Good. 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 Now, this time, I'm going to take it, take it, I'm going to drop it right in front of you. So you're just going to small pick. Good. There you go. Good. Now, if that ball's going to bounce here, I don't want you to be up and see how much room is it? I want you to be to yeah, get your hands out in front more so you can pick it right where it's going to, yeah. There you go. You're going to go Left toe up, right foot back, and just get in that position. What I want you to think about is you're using your right hip to put the gas pedal down. So you're pushing off this. You're not pushing up. You're pushing in. So this hip is driving in. That's what's going to push you to, to your target. Again, but only get to about right there. Yes, yes. The gas pedal is right when it hits your glove. Your foot, and this works at the same time. Hing, hing, hing. Push off like a rocket. Get, get into that position again. Good. Hands out in front. I want you to feel like that. Create that momentum. Yeah. yeah there you go. Yeah. Now. With this movement, right, you want to make sure that when you field, when your gas is going down and you're getting ready, look, you don't want this because now your body's like, okay, now what? Now I got to shuffle again to get ready. So when I'm in my position and I do, I'm in this position. No. Yes. Just like you're starting the engine of a car, just like you're getting ready, like a pulse. Vroom. Boom. That's it. You want the smoothness to look like this. Not. Or. It's. You know what I'm saying? It's called, it's called around the horn. You're going to do five in a row. Boom. Shuffle. Reset right there. Dun, 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 dun. Same thing. Toes up. Time it and push. Good, get that toe up so the timing, there you go. So now we're gonna add the right left to it. So now I'm in my position. When I see the ball now, it's gonna be boom, boom. Position, I'm gonna go right foot, boom. Was, yep, now it's heel. Right, because remember, I gotta push my gas down. If I just go right, left, and I'm flat, you know what I'm saying? You see, you see your weight staying over there? The second your heel goes down, your body's now in this position. So now you're fielding it like this. You want to feel it like this. Boom. So when this ball is coming to you on this line, 
you want to make sure that you are here to then field. Don't just stay straight and be like, because now you're fielding in here. On every ball to be caught off your left hip, your left eye, and a dead left arm right here. Boom. I'm going to drop this down, and right when it hits the ground, you're going to work through the short hop and just shuffle the first. Now, when it hits, don't scoop up. I want you to... Yeah. Oh. I'm going to bounce it this time. The second bounce, you're going to work the same footwork, but you're just going to do the timing on your own. So I'm not just going to stand here and drop. I'm going to slam it here. You're going to see the ball in the air. You're going to set yourself up and work through the next short hop. Ready? Good. Good. When you field this ball, right, I want you to be like you're, like you're giving me a high five, like you're pushing into my hand. Right? You see how your hand is like this? This is what I want when you're fielding. Not this. Because when you flick it and do this to yourself, like that's when you're, you want to be, here it is, it's a boom. So your hand's solid right here. So it's, oh, there's the short hop. Oh, backhand. Oh, there you go. I'm not going to scoop it, scoop it out. See what happens? I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to rake through, rake through. I'm not going to catch and scoop to myself. I'm boom, boom, boom. Let's rock out some backhands now. So we're going to rock out some backhands. Simple positioning. We're going to get on our line. We're gonna get into this position. Your glove's gonna be like this. I'm gonna drop it here. You're just gonna push off and get ready. I'm gonna drop it. You're here, push off and get ready. Lever number one, lever number two, lever number three. So all this stuff has to be able to work. So the lower I get, the more all these can stay bent. As soon as one of them locks out, now I'm stuck. And you're gonna use this leg to push off to get you so your gloves barely gonna move your legs are gonna bring you where yep nice there you go there you go working the hands boom ready yes yeah beautiful Good feet are getting, is what gives you good hops and what takes all the stress off this because we're moving through the throw, not just, and now all of a sudden I got to throw a cannon with this thing every time. We're going to go right, left, right, left, right, field and push off. So to go fast is just going to look like this. So your feet are always moving, short and choppy. Yeah, yeah. I can see them this way. I need you to be down here. I need you to get your face more to the level of the ball and not so upright. Down. Freeze right there. Boom. And then it's after the field. That's when it's I'm staying here. That's when you're going. See, when, I'm, see how, when I bring it to myself, I'm here. Opposed to. Yeah, love it, love it. Two more. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, nice, nice. You feeling it? You understand what I'm, we're trying to get? Stay low, keep your feet moving, drive through with your legs. He's doing good, man. He's doing good. Just came off surgery. Just came back, working on some footwork stuff. Trying to keep that arm slot nice and short. Having some fun with him. Came from Staten Island. Wanted to get a little eval before the, the season coming up. He's doing great. RJ. I'm going to take this baseball and toss it up into the air. When it goes up into the air, you're going to go right, left. When it hits the ground, you're going to boom. Be on your hop. So it's. time 136 pitches a game 136 pitches. you have to be on time on time on time it's not boom it's hit it's
Boom, it's it. Got it? Good follow through. Good. Let's look at those. That's that's better. That's better. Now it's a Dude, that's what I'm talking about. That's the arm slot. So you see how it barely it barely snookered over the top of this. It barely caught this and you caught this. Like you need that thing to be like boom. 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 And you're feeling it right off your pointer finger. Right there. You're showing the point. Like there's an eyeball right on that thing. Boom. 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 That's is that too is that too deep for you, bro? Is that too deep? Alright, you got it. Yeah, now just pin your eyeballs on that baby. Come on, now now we're going to the next level. Come over here. If you can handle if you can handle the big boy. I don't know if you can handle it, but take your glove off and just put that on. You're just gonna field with it. I want you to pretend that your ring finger and your pinky finger are off your hand and you don't even have one. Like a claw. So you're shooting this out, boom. That pointer finger knuckles right at me, and here's where you're fielding the baseball. Boom. Show me that pointer finger knuckle, though. Show me that pointer finger knuckle. Mm, 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 mm. There you go. Listen, eyeballs locked in more. I want you to. That, mean, that means I got to get my vector ball. Where is that guy? Here it is. When the ball hits your glove, I want you to tell me what color it is. All right. You're not colorblind, are you? The last kid I did this was colorblind, and he was getting it wrong every time. Good. That was real good. If I'm fielding the baseball off my right side, it's pulling me away. See what I mean? I, I, I can't see where my glove is. Now, if I keep that same thing to my left and I'm here, boom, that's our move. If I'm straight on and I go to step now and it's by, I can't even, even if my head's down, look where my glove is. You want this thing, boom, everything stays in a straight line here. <sighs> now we're talking, working the vector ball. Guy's not keeping his head down. Use the vector ball. It flashes right when he catches it. And he's calling it just like this. Red. That's how it's done. One more. Let's see what he's got. Yeah. Nice. Call it a day. Yep. RJ did great. Had to work on some work on. Come on in, RJ. Work on staying low. Work on through the ball. Work on some footwork stuff. Really had to work on the arm slot. Overall, great lesson. Can't wait to see him next time.